If you're looking to make some extra money each and every month, then you should consider implementing a side hustle. One of the best things about a side hustle is that you can utilize that money to supplement your nine to five income, or you can go full steam ahead and you can try to completely replace your nine to five income with a side hustle. Well, in today's video, I'm gonna be going over six side hustles that will allow you to make a ton of money in your spare time that can potentially allow you to get out of your nine to five and completely start your own business. Now, out of the six side hustles that I'm gonna go over in today's video, I can tell you that I am actively doing two of the six, and who knows, I may actually try a few of the others that I'm gonna cover in this video. I'll be providing a rating for each of the side hustles that I cover in today's video, and that rating will include how easy it is to get set up with that side hustle, and I'll also give a rating for how much money that that side hustle can earn you each and every month. Side hustle number one is delivery service. So most people are aware of the ride share companies such as Uber and Lyft, but there is a huge opportunity in the delivery service category for you to make a lot of money. Companies such as Walmart allow their customers to buy goods online and then have them delivered to their home. Walmart hires drivers to come and pick up those goods and actually deliver those to people's houses. So not only will you get paid to deliver goods on behalf of companies such as Walmart, you will also have an opportunity to get tips from customers when you deliver the goods to their house. Now, I can tell you, I use Walmart's delivery service all the time, and I think this is a fantastic opportunity for anyone that's looking to make some additional money. So another opportunity in the delivery service category is medication. So companies such as Walgreens and Rite Aid will allow their customers to place orders for their medication online, and then they will hire a driver to deliver those medications to their customers. It's similar to how Walmart is set up. Companies such as Walgreens will hire the driver to deliver the medication to someone's home. And again, you have an opportunity to get paid for making that delivery, but you also have an opportunity to make tips whenever you make those deliveries. So that's two examples in the delivery service category that you can get started with relatively easy. So as far as my rating for how easy it is to get set up and establish to make these deliveries on behalf of a Walmart or a Walgreens, I would give it a four out of five. And depending on where you live in the country, you can make a lot of money doing this every single month. So my rating that I would give for the amount of money that you could make for these delivery services would be a three out of five. Side hustle number two is starting an online store. You can start an online store on a site such as Etsy that will literally allow you to sell virtually anything. You could sell shirts, you could sell hats, you could sell coffee mugs, you could sell productivity calendars, or you could sell things such as books. And the best part about this is you can do this on demand. Meaning you don't have to carry a ton of inventory in order to get your store set up with Etsy. The second type of online store would be on a site such as eBay. eBay would allow you to list items that you currently own that you don't utilize. You can list them on their site via auction or for direct buy. And once that item sells and you ship it out, then you would get paid. Setting up an online store would take some time and some effort. So my rating on how easy it would be to set up an online store on a site such as Etsy would be a three out of five. And my rating for the amount of money that this side hustle could generate would be a four out of five. Side hustle number three is freelance work. You can go on a site such as Fiverr and you can advertise your services for sale on that site. So for example, if you're a graphic designer, you can show some of the previous work that you've completed for clients and you can sell your services by the hour or by the project. If you're a web developer, you can sell web development services. You can sell photography services or you can just sell general business consulting services on a site such as Fiverr. And if you're good at your craft, this would allow you to make a tremendous amount of money as a side hustle. So for the amount of effort that it would take to get set up with an account on Fiverr and starting to sell your services, I would give that a four 
out of five. And I would also give this a four out of five star rating on the amount of money that you could make selling your services on a site such as Fiverr. And side hustle number four is creating an online course. So for example, if you are an expert in a program such as Excel, you can create an Excel for Beginners course and post that on a site such as Skillshare, which allows creators to create content and put that on their site, and then they will be paid based on the number of users that take their course. Now here's the best part about this. If you are an expert in a program such as Excel, you can then create an intermediate course and an expert course and post those on Skillshare as well. And then on top of that, if you are an expert in a program such as PowerPoint, you can do the same thing with PowerPoint, PowerPoint for beginners, an intermediate PowerPoint class, and also an expert PowerPoint class. And there you would have six courses that you've created and posted on Skillshare that will allow you to generate money every single month. And the list goes on and on for the number of courses that you would be able to create and post on a site such as Skillshare and make money every single month. So my rating for the amount of effort that it would take to create an online course and post it on a site such as Skillshare would be three out of five. And my rating for the amount of money that you could make every single month by having your online course on a site such as Skillshare is five out of five. And side hustle number five is creating a YouTube channel. So YouTube allows you to create content and post that on their site. And once you have a certain amount of criteria that you've achieved, then you will be able to be paid through YouTube. To this point, I have not met that criteria, but it's absolutely something that I'm working on as a side hustle that I want to put a lot of time and energy in in 2024. And not only are you able to get paid from YouTube, you can get paid from affiliate marketing as well. So if you're looking to start creating content and make money while you're doing that, then you should absolutely look into starting a YouTube channel. And my rating for the amount of effort that it would take to start a YouTube channel would be a five out of five. And my rating for the amount of revenue that you could generate by having a successful YouTube channel would be a five out of five. And the sixth side hustle is getting a real estate license. This is something that I did back in 2020 and it has allowed me to make a lot of money over the last four years. So once you have your real estate license, there are several ways that you could make money. The first and obvious way is representing a buyer or seller in a real estate transaction. The next way would be starting a property management company that you can run from your own home. This would allow you to manage properties from large apartment complexes to single family homes that are owned by investors. You could also refer potential clients to other agents that will allow you to be paid a referral fee once the transaction is closed on their home. Now becoming a real estate agent does take some time and some effort and some energy to put into doing this. But I can tell you, it has the potential to make you a ton of money. So my rating for how easy it would be to get your real estate license and get that all set up would be a two out of five. But the amount of money that you could make as a side hustle in real estate I would give that a rating of five out of five. So there's six side hustles that you can do that will allow you to make a ton of money. Now, as I was coming up with the ideas for this video, I did have a few additional side hustles that I had in mind that I didn't cover in today's video. If you'd like for me to cover those additional side hustles in a future video, just let me know. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.